And you're talking about healthy. The Pacers might be the most unlucky team in the league, Mike, when it comes to the injuries. You can go back to 2011 when they had a guy named Danny Granger. Sabono is second in rebound in last season, 12 a game, and six assists. Finding Holiday that time, creating off the glass. Beautiful backdoor cut. Previously, Randall, a UFO from the corner. Walker makes his drive, gets past Brogdon, gets inside. Kemba Walker for the first bucket. But the play's much bigger as he penetrates and creates. There's Lamb back out to Turner. Turner goes inside, lays it up and in. A wide open defensively that time. Walker to Barrett. Barrett, three-pointer is good. Last year, I believe he was number one. Walker gets inside, pulls up, foul line jumpers, got it. He can flat out score. Yeah, good job by Holiday on his case. Randall on the drive, kicks it out. Fournier, a corner three. Ten straight points by the Knicks. Yeah, that catapulted him into the national spotlight for sure. Randall trying to find his game. And knocks it down, so all five Knicks starters have scored. He had to score a lot every night last year for the Knicks to win. He might not have to do that this year because he's got some help as Holiday drills a three. Randall averaged 10 bounds last season. Gibson. Taj oh. Gibson knocks down a three-pointer. Gibson doesn't take a lot of threes. He only took 15 all last year. That time shooting with a lot of confidence and not hesitating. Devastated. Randall with the steal. Brogdon tries to take it away, but Randall able to hold on. You can see Randall now on top of the game. He started the game with an air ball, missed the layup. Fournier drives, draws some contact, knocks it down, and one. Alley up inside for Sims. Barks and Sims in the first bucket for the rookie. Rising and surprising them that time. Turner from outside. Duarte, the rookie, out to Brogdon who nails the three. Of course, Duarte, the number three for Indiana, the rookie for Morgan. And think that he has a chance to be right into the rotation and be an impact player. Derek Rose, up and under. Sweet move from Rose. Feline quickness along the baseline for Rose. One of the first things he noted quickly and his handling skills talking to quickly about it he says i want to be a leader on the floor i want to do everything as ob top and hits a nice nice bucket rick carlisle says duarte and jackson have a chance to be so good and again will play important minutes for this pacer team quickly with a sweet move off the glass deputy for burke just standing there counting the house ball bounced right to him Duarte comes right back. We mentioned about Summer League, you don't get carried away, but Duarte very impressive in the Summer League. O'Shea Brissett, the third-year man who played his college ball at Syracuse. He's in the game for the first time. Oh, good shot. Oh, nice. Yeah. Drew some contact. Burks bumped into him. Chance for a three-point play from the 24-year-old rookie. Quickly, Rose, Toppin, Burks, and Sims out there. Obi Toppin. Exuding a lot of confidence in his game. Brissett misses. Remember last year, Clyde, when Toppin would get the ball, he releases down the other end, throws it down. You got as a point guard, you've got to know who's hot and who's not. Derek Rose kicks it out. Nice setup for Alec Burks. Knicks have hit five three-pointers. They have 43 points already. And previously, Toppin was the beneficiary. Quickly from deep. Way off. There's Craig. Nice advance pass. Not a good move by Toppin. Toppin running down the other end. Layup. Shot won't go. Brissett able to defend. Tom Thibodeau thought there was a foul. There's oh. McConnell. Oh, nice little hesitation stutter move. Things did not waste any time after leaving Dallas. It's their third coach in a year as Kemba Walker knocks it down. And McMillan, of course, did a fabulous job with Atlanta last year after taking over for Lloyd Pierce. And Pierce, ironically, is now He's with, with the Pacers. <laughs> yeah. Holiday fix. Pacers very persistent. Will not go away. They're back in this game. The oldest Holiday brother knocks it down. He's become a, a really good player. 
Of course, Drew just won a championship. Nice feet inside. Gibson to Randall with a foul. Yeah, fourth shot of a two of his bounce. Pacers are back. Pacers have tightened up their defense, folks. That's why they're getting back in the game. R.J. Barrett, good steady jumper right there. His second field goal. They've got they've had three different head coaches in the past year, and it's hard to get that continuity with that. R.J. Barrett, impressive again. Years ago, that was a, considered a bad shot what Brogdon took, but today's NBA, if you're wide open from three, like <laughs> Kemba Walker was, you knock it down. Yeah, his brother's no longer on the team, Mike. Remember, Aaron was with them last yep. year. They traded him to Washington. Uh -oh. As Randall tips it up and in. Obi Toppin has moved ahead of him in the rotation last year and perhaps to start this year. Final seconds, Randall gets the jumper off and knocks it down as the buzzer sounds. He thought he got fouled too, but he'll take the two point. Paces with their second unit out there now starting. Fournier, the next leading score, gets it into Gibson. And nice layup and the foul. Two. You, you cannot overstate, as Brissett misses, the importance of Taj Gibson to last year's success. Barrett, nice steal. Knicks have a two-on-one. Barrett goes right at Duarte. Tough shot, and he gets the roll. You know, Clyde, he, he's so appreciative of what this game has given him. Yeah. And all his coaches and all his teammates, as Barrett knocks down a three, are appreciative of what kind of man and what kind of teammate he is. Like in uh, trying to get Fournier and Walker some good quality time with the guys they'll be on the floor with. Walker for three. Boy, the Knicks, 80 points. Gibson baseline. He has a hook shot in his repertoire. How about Taj Gibson tonight? Knicks leading score with 14 points. There all the players saying they want to be two-way players now, Mike. Barrett, that's what he's talking about now, improving his D. Sims on the slam on a gorgeous setup from Kemba Walker. You know, of a scorer's mentality. Obviously, Walker and Rose as Randall knocks down the three. They uh, they both can distribute quickly, really coming along nice. Rose telegraphing that bounce pass. Nice feed to Sims. Sims uh, doesn't show much offense other than a dunk. R.J. Barrett with his third three-pointer. He's got seven. Um, he just he's, he's in the right spot a lot, isn't he? Oh, what a splendid pass by Rose. Hook shot. <laughs> <laughs> Kicks it back out. McConnell. T.J. McConnell able nope. to connect. Nobody. Well, I hope so. Well, obviously, it'll be a tremendous honor again. The, the, actually, the 50 greatest was the highlight of my career when you think of all the players, folks, that have played in the NBA. Burks couldn't quite control the defensive rebound. Craig gets inside. Yeah, a bucket that time, Duarte. And some teams are hesitant to, to draft those players that, that go the four years, but they're more certainly NBA ready in most cases. And at 24, he's almost the oldest guy on the team. <laughs> 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 Quickly comes up with a turnover, brings it up with Rose, Toppin, Burks, and Jericho Sims. Quickly drills one. Quickly didn't play the first game. Got a DNP, coach's decision. As Sykes, keeper Sykes, nails a three-pointer. It's worth it, Mike, when you see the, the money the guys are making now. All you need is like one season. <laughs> Those 50 and 45 minutes are for players who, who are reserves, not necessarily <laughs> starters. Yeah, it's, it's, it's uncanny. And now they're talking about the new contract, and that will really catapult the salaries for. Toppin again showing that ball handling to spin the lamp. Oh, that's a sweet move. It's getting closer. <laughs> uh, this kid is 